Thank you for visiting your undertaker. In the annals of criminal history, certain murder cases stand out for their extraordinary and chilling nature. These cases push the boundaries of human depravity and leave us questioning the depths of the human psyche. Join us as we delve into the dark side of humanity and explore the top 10 most crazy murders that have captivated the public's fascination for their sheer audacity and disturbing details. The Black Dahlia Murder One of the most infamous unsolved murders, the Black Dahlia Murder refers to the brutal killing and mutilation of Elizabeth Short in 1947. Short's body was found in a vacant lot, bisected at the waist with a Glasgow smile carved into her face. The case remains an enigma, captivating the public's imagination and inspiring numerous theories and speculations. The Zodiac Killer operating in the late 1960s and early 1970s, the Zodiac Killer terrorized the San Francisco Bay Area, taunting authorities with cryptic messages and ciphers. The killer's identity remains unknown, adding to the mystique surrounding the case. The Zodiac's calculated and taunting nature make this one of the most notorious serial killer cases in history. The Axeman of New Orleans During the early 20th century, New Orleans was plagued by a string of grisly murders committed by the Axeman. The killer's modus operandi involved breaking into homes and bludgeoning his victims with an axe. The case became even more bizarre when the Axeman sent a letter claiming to be a supernatural being sparing anyone who played jazz music on a particular night. The Hillside Stranglers active in the late 1970s, cousins Angelo Bono and Kenneth Bianchi terrorized Los Angeles by abducting, assaulting, and murdering young women. Their choice of victims and the sadistic nature of their crimes shocked the nation. The Hillside Stranglers' reign of terror ended when Bianchi was apprehended, leading to the capture and conviction of both perpetrators. The clown killer John Wayne Gacy, also known as the Clown Killer, was a seemingly affable man who entertained children as a clown. Unbeknownst to his community, Gacy had a sinister double life as a serial killer, sexually assaulting and murdering young boys. The discovery of multiple bodies buried beneath his home shocked the nation and forever associated clowns with fear. The Vampire of Sacramento Richard Chase, known as the Vampire of Sacramento, committed a series of gruesome murders in the 1970s. Chase believed that he needed to consume the blood of his victims to prevent his own blood from turning to powder. His erratic behavior and gruesome crimes earned him a place in the macabre Hall of Fame of serial killers. The Toy Box Killer David Parker Ray, also known as the Toy Box Killer, was a sadistic sexual predator who kidnapped, tortured, and raped multiple women in a soundproof trailer equipped with horrifying instruments. Ray's meticulously planned and grotesque crimes shocked investigators, and the revelations of what occurred inside his toy box are among the most disturbing in criminal history. The Moors murders Ian Brady and Myra Hindley terrorized England in the 1960s, abducting and murdering five children and teenagers. The couple buried their victims on the desolate Saddleworth Moor, and the horrific nature of their crimes sent shockwaves through the nation. The case remains a haunting reminder of the depths of human depravity. The Toolbox Killers Lawrence Bittaker and Roy Norris, known as the Toolbox Killers, embarked on a sadistic spree of abduction, torture, and murder in the late 1970s. They used a toolbox filled with tools to inflict unimaginable pain on their victims. The chilling recordings of their crimes, referred to as the torture tapes, serve as evidence of their depravity and continue to disturb investigators and the public. The Manson Family Murders The Manson Family Murders remain one of the most infamous and disturbing crime sprees in American history. Led by the charismatic and manipulative Charles Manson, a cult-like group known as the Manson Family carried out a series of brutal murders in Los Angeles during the summer of 1969. Charles Manson, a failed musician and aspiring cult leader, convinced his followers that he was a messiah-like figure with a vision of an apocalyptic race war he called Helter Skelter. He believed that by committing violent crimes and framing them as racially motivated, he could incite this war and emerge as the leader of a new world order. On the night of August 8, 1969, Manson instructed four of his followers, Charles Tex Watson, Susan Atkins, 
Patricia Krenwinkel, and Linda Kasabian, to go to the residence of actress Sharon Tate, who was eight months pregnant at the time, and kill everyone inside. The group brutally murdered Sharon Tate, who pleaded for the life of her unborn child, as well as four others who were present in the house, Jay Sebring, Abigail Folger, Wojciech Frykowski, and Stephen Parent. The following night, Manson directed his followers to the home of Leno and Rosemary La Bianca. In a chilling display of violence, the couple was brutally stabbed to death, and the word war was carved into Leno's stomach with a fork. The Manson family's acts of violence sent shockwaves throughout the nation and marked the end of the peaceful and hopeful spirit of the 1960s. The murders were particularly shocking due to the randomness of the victims and the sheer brutality with which the crimes were committed. During the subsequent trial, Manson and his followers displayed bizarre behavior, often chanting and carving X's into their foreheads. Manson attempted to use the trial as a platform to propagate his twisted ideology, creating a spectacle that captivated the media and the public. Manson himself died in prison in 2017 at the age of 83. The case has fascinated and disturbed generations, serving as a chilling example of the capacity for evil that can exist within certain individuals and the lasting impact they can have on society. The Manson family murders not only shocked the nation but also changed the public's perception of safety and innocence, forever leaving a dark mark on the history of true crime. The legacy of the Manson family and their horrific acts of violence continues to serve as a cautionary tale, reminding us of the importance of remaining vigilant against the influence of dangerous ideologies and charismatic figures. These ten cases represent some of the most heinous and shocking murders in history. From the unsolved mystery of the Black Dahlia to the sadistic crimes of the toolbox killers, these cases have left an indelible mark on society's collective consciousness. They reveal the depths of human evil and the extent to which some individuals are capable of committing unimaginable acts of violence. While these cases are terrifying, they also serve as a reminder of the importance of justice, investigation, and the resilience of those who work tirelessly to bring criminals to account. The stories of these murders intrigue and horrify us, forcing us to confront the darkest corners of the human mind. It is crucial to remember the victims and honor their memories as we strive to understand and prevent such atrocities from occurring again. These cases serve as cautionary tales, urging us to remain vigilant and proactive in our efforts to create a safer society for all. As we delve into the details of these murders, we must approach them with sensitivity and respect for the victims and their families. By studying and learning from these crimes, we can shed light on the complexities of human behavior and hopefully prevent future acts of violence. In the face of these horrifying facts about serial killers, we must unite in our commitment to justice, compassion, and the pursuit of a safer world for everyone. Thank you for watching your Undertaker. It would be in your best interests to like and subscribe.